Hello, kindergarten friends. Welcome to the magical world of Mrs. White's Kindergarten Corner this morning. I have an awesome unicorn story for you. First, um, I wanna start with a unicorn joke. Why do unicorns um, like silly jokes? Because they're unicorny. Ha ha ha, right? Okay, shout out to some friends today on Wednesday. May 27th. Afternoon, friends. Hello, Sage and Ellie and Caleb and Sadie and Mackenzie. And morning, friends. Hello, Emmett and Landon Anderson and Delaney and Logan. All right, are you ready for my awesome unicorn story? I am more than ready. All right. How to catch a unicorn. Hmm. What do we already think? Fact or fiction this book? Well, this is gonna be a really fun fiction book, right? And it is um, written by Adam Wallace and illustrated by Andy Elkerton. The kids think they have spotted me. I thought I'd blend in here. I cannot let they ca them catch me or my magic will disappear. You see right here, it says Z-O-O, -O, zoo. Is that a unicorn? I think they can fly. They leave a trail of glitter behind. I heard they can shriek. Let's catch it. You see the unicorn? Oh, he's playing hide and seek. Here we've got the zoo. We've got swans and lions, zebras, um, giraffe, monkeys. Badgers, peacocks. There's the unicorn up here in the room. Luckily, my animal friends from the zebra to the ape are all on board to help me. They will make sure I escape. It's a brand new book. First, I see my stripy cousins, but then I have to fly. As much as I like lemonade, I have to say goodbye. Right here it says unicorn lemonade, because here come the kids trying to catch the unicorn. I dodge the plastic parachute being launched from down below. I do a spin and leave a trail of glitter as I go. Wouldn't that be cool? chill with all my penguin pals, but these traps are everywhere. I'll head to the nocturnal house. I hope it's safe in there. This big sign right here says, see cutest unicorn here, but there he goes flying off. Maybe it's a she. Wow, this room is super dark. I'm a glad I'm a unicorn. Who knows what I might walk into without my magic horn. They're trying to trap the unicorn with the ice cream. Do you see it? Now I'm off to see more friends. It's time to shrink my size, but it sure is hard to see and hear with all these butterflies. The butterflies are the same color as the rainbow trail. It says unicorns eat for free. My nose smells something super sweet coming from the cafe. Oh, yum, I snag a little bite before I fly away. Can you see how it shrunk itself to be tiny, tiny, tiny? Next up, I go to where it's hot, where there's lots of scales. The snakes and lizards help me through with their clever use of tails. Ka-chop! I'm big again, and with more friends, these monkeys make me laugh. But would I have been caught so easily if it were not for the giraffe? But it says, but would I have been caught easily if not for the giraffe? So the giraffe helped the unicorn escape. What's over there? A paddle boat? This could be lots of fun. I would stay in the water, but my friends are roaring. Can you still see the back of the unicorn? While visiting my beaver friends, I spy a welcome sight. My true friends have come to save the day with their bold, brave 
spirit beaver bite. Right here it says unicorn castle. And here comes the trail. And there's the unicorn's backside. The gift makes the perfect place for your, the gift shop makes the perfect place for your elaborate trap. But luckily for me, there's a decoy to safely take the wrap. Look right here, there's this. There's another magical animal, the, nar the narwhal. I had fun with my friends today. The zoo has been a blast. You tried your best, your traps were smart, but unicorns are fast. Now it's time for me to go and maybe take a nap. Meanwhile, keep on trying, kids. I'll be back to test your traps. There goes the unicorn. Right here. Better luck next time. That's a fun, fun fiction book, right? All right. Um, I hope things are going well on your sightword projects. I have seen a lot of good work and a lot of fun ideas and some super weights to practice sight words. The last um, few days when people have been submitting their work, it's not due until Friday, so you still have a few more days to work on it. And friends, if the sight words are hard, um, use the words that you can read really easily to include in your sight word project. All right, have a super Wednesday. See you tomorrow for another story, another unicorn story. Bye-bye.